Let us understand star delta transformation and how do we apply for different circuits. Star, the alternative names for star are Y, T, 4 wave system. So the four ends are A, B, C and the midpoint which is known as N, that is neutral. Delta, so delta, the alternative names are mesh, pi or 3 wave system. Three ends are A, B, C and N which all in star would not appear in delta. So let us understand first delta to star followed by star to delta transformation. So the knowns are delta, we are going to derive the equation for R A, R B, R C with respect to delta elements R A B, R B C and R C A. So for delta network shown, what is the equivalent resistance across A B? So across A B one can neglect point C, thus R C A and R B C appears in series. Then these two branches are in parallel, right? So that is shown in equation 1. Similarly, in star network, what is the equivalent resistance across AB? So when you see here, when a person stands from point A and needs to travel to point B, he travels through RA and RB. Thus, we can neglect RC. I hope you have understood why are we neglecting RC. Thus, we can read the circuit as shown and the R equivalent across AB is RA plus RB. For equivalence, we equate equation 1 which is equal to equation 2 as shown in equation A. For delta network, what is the equivalent resistance across BC? Neglecting point A, RAB and RCA appears in series. And these two branches are in parallel. Thus, we can rewrite them in equation 3 as shown here. Similarly, for star network, what is the equivalent resistance across BC? we can neglect RA. I hope you understood why are we neglecting RA. Thus, as shown in the figure, across BC the equivalent resistance is RB plus RC. For equivalence, equating equation 3 and 4 as shown in equation B. Similarly, for delta network, what is the equivalent resistance across CA? Neglecting point B, RAB plus RBC are in series and these two branches are in parallel. This we write them as equation 5. For star network, what is the equivalent resistance across CA? So here one can neglect RB, right? Thus across CA, the equivalent resistance is RC plus RA. The equivalence is as shown in equation C. Thus ABC are the equivalence of star and delta. By adding equation A, B and C, on the LHS, we have RA plus RB plus RB plus RC plus RC plus RA. Similarly, on the RHS, so let us see how do we add. On the LHS, it can be re reduced as shown here. Similarly, in the RHS, we can reduce as the denominator is common. We can add. But one can observe that RAB, RC appears twice. RAB, RBC appears twice. And RCA, RBC appears twice. Thus, rating as shown here. This can be further reduced as shown in equation D. Cancelling the constant 2 on both sides. From equation D one can find RA, RB or RC. So let's see. Let us find RA and then find out how do we solve, how do we find for RB and RC. So when we equate RA from equation D, we get the equation as shown. We have to substitute the equation for RB plus RC from equation D. Now this can be further reduced. As the denominator is common, we can subtract on the RHS. But we can observe that RAB, RBC, they are same, but with opposite polarity, thus they cancel. Similarly, RBC, RCA, they are same, and they can cancel because they are with opposite polarities. Thus, RA is equal to RCA into RAB divided by RAB plus RBC plus RCA. Thus, we have converted, or we have converted the equivalent delta to star. So, let's see. So, this is the star delta network RAB, RBC, RCA, where we require the star network RA, RB, RC. We have now derived for RA and let us find, write the equation for RB and RC. So, one can see RA is in contact with two delta elements, which are those two RA and RAB and RCA. Those, thus, product of those two divided by the summation of all the delta elements. Can we now equate for RB? So, RB is in contact with which two delta elements? R A B and R B C. So product of those two divided by summation of all the three delta elements. 
Similarly, how do we write for RC? RC is in contact with which two delta elements? R, B, C and R, C. A. So product of these two divided by the summation of all the delta elements. Thus, for known delta, its equivalent star is derived. Now, let us derive star to delta transformation with the help of these three equations. For star to delta transformation, multiply equations EF and FG and G. Let us take one by one. So when we multiply EF on the LHS we have A into B on the RHS we have multiplied and the denominator square and one can observe in the numerator in equation E and equation F we have RAB twice thus RAB square. Similarly now when we multiply FG on the LHS we have RB into RC. Similarly now on the RHS we will we'll have RCA into RAB into RBC square. So one can analyze for G into E. This equation can be further reduced as shown below and this can further be reduced as shown as equation H. Now using equation EFGH we can now equate or find the equivalent delta parameters RAB, RBC and RCA. So one has to divide equation H by equation E or equation F or equation G. So we are showing for one and then we will analyze for other two parameters. This is for equation H on the LHS and this is equation E on the LHS and this is equation H on the RHS, this is equation E on the RHS. So one can observe the sum terms cancel. right? So you can see on the LHS, we can rewrite as shown here, in the RHS the cancel out and the left over is RBC. So this is its equivalent delta. So now between these three points, the known where star now we have derived its equivalent delta that is RBC. So one can see or one can inspect for other three other two delta parameters. Let us see. Now RBC is in contact with which two known star RB and RC. So product of those two plus their summation divided by the one which appears perpendicular, perpendicular to RBC that is RA. Similarly let us now equate or write the equation for RAB. RAB is in contact with which two star elements? That is RA and RB. So product of those two plus their summation and we have to divide for only the product RA in by RA into RB. So which is that division? That is the one which is perpendicular. That is RC. Similarly, how do we write for RCA? Which two are in contact with RCA? RA and RC. So product of those two which appears perpendicular RB divided by RB plus the summation of those two which are in contact with RCA that is RA plus RC. Thank you.